What is going on guys? Thanks for tuning in today's video. Today I got a quick episode for you, some kind of cheapest professional episode. And yes, today we are going to talk about my camera back. I will get my camera back now, but one of the coolest things about YouTube is that everything just goes so easy. For example, I would like to have the backpack now, so I just clap. There we go, here's the camera back. So let's start with today's video, intro. got some questions on this camera bag and on camera bags in general which camera bag you should get and this is what I think is the best vintage camera bag for its price and maybe you think the same after this video this camera bag bag is called the KNF Concept 600D it's a cool camera bag and it only costs 60 bucks which I think is not so much for such a backpack so as I said you can find this backpack on Amazon for around 60 dollars and I think it's a good price for the backpack. I will go through the backpack now a little bit, show you some things that I like about it, some things that I don't like about it. Because there are also some downsides with this bag, but I will show you why I love this backpack. Okay, maybe I should start now with when and why I got this camera bag. I got this backpack around half a year ago, and ever since then I only used this backpack when I was out there shooting videos and photos. And the main reason I bought this camera bag is because of the look, because I think just that's something that is important for me, the look of a backpack. Okay, the look of the camera backpack is super important for me because these standard camera bags that everyone has, these black bags, I don't like them, they don't look so amazing. I have one here, I can show. Okay, to show you this now, this is my older camera bag. It's from another company called Sunrise. Stupid name. But anyway, it's a standard camera bag. Black, chunky, big thing. And yes, I don't like this kind of bag, so I got this one. This is more like a vintage style camera bag. I just like the look of this camera bag, you know, like you're that kind of photographer having this camera bag, then you got the old vintage camera and you're just cool. Okay, that was a stupid argument to buy this backpack. The next step, what I also like about this camera bag, it does not only carry your camera, but also other stuff. Maybe I should show it now. At the bottom of the camera bag, you got the main compartment of the camera bag and there you can fit maybe like two or three lenses, smaller lenses and the main camera and maybe like a tripod or a microphone and then at the top of the camera bag you can still fit something else in here you can put for example I have sunglasses yeah the coolest thing about this backpack you can still put something in there at the top you can put maybe like something to eat or anything else at the very top of the backpack is a zipper and you can fit something like headphones, you can fit your phone in there or your wallet. That's also super cool on the side, you can stick something. I have this hand here now which I use for skateboarding. But you could also stick a water bottle in there or a tripod, that's super cool. The next up we got on the front here a smaller compartment. You can fit something like ND filters in there or some filters. You can just basically... And phone call ended. Who is trying to interrupt this tutorial or whatever this is? You can fit something like a sun cream because it got super hot here. Always protect your skin, that's super important. <laughs> okay, then next up I would like to show you this. At the side you can also open the backpack here. And this is super handy because you can get your camera here. And it's just a fast way of grabbing your camera for example we put this old camera in there but I don't know if you can see it now but if I open it up here I can easily grab this take photos put it in there and also here we got two compartments to carry batteries or SD cards or something else in terms of build quality this camera backpack is okay it's not super nice but it feels high quality and yeah, I would say the quality of this backpack is pretty good the only thing that I have to say it's not like it's not so strong I don't know how to explain this now but I just mean like everything kind of 
falls together, it's like not so strong. Then another thing I should maybe tell you, you can carry a lot of gear with this camera bag. It works perfectly fine with something I use with a smaller camera and maybe I have one lens in there, a microphone, a mini tripod. It works fine if you have some stuff in there, but I would say you can't fit like a Canon 1DX and two lenses. It's just like that won't work. You can't put everything in there. I would say you can maybe put a smaller camera and two lenses in there, maybe a microphone, but you can carry like a red and put it in there. That won't work. But me personally, I don't have so much to carry. Second call in one video. Little brother. Hello there. Was sagst du dazu, dass du gerade das Video gestört hast? These stupid kids interrupting my videos. Okay, let's go on now. For me personally, that's not such a problem because I don't have to carry a lot of gear. Like I wouldn't need the whole size of the camera backpack just for gear, so I can fit some other stuff in there. Okay, I think that was pretty much it. There is one more thing. Third call in one video. I think I should just stop creating YouTube videos. It's not possible anymore. Okay, the last but not least thing I like about this camera backpack, it's also safe. Because if you notice, you open this backpack from the back and not from the front. And so pickpockets or any thieves can steal you anything. So for all your pickpockets out there, I'm protected. You can't steal anything. Okay, I think now that was pretty much it. And I can now give you my final thoughts on this camera backpack. Yes, I like this camera backpack for a lot of good reasons, but there are also some things I don't like about this camera backpack, which I told you about, but in all I would say it's a good camera backpack if you're just starting out and you want something that is stylish and also good. It's just like a functional camera backpack and for the price it's around $60 and I think you won't find anything that is as good as this for this price. So that's why I would pick up this camera backpack. Last thing this video is by no means sponsored. I think you would also not believe me if I would say this video would be sponsored. I just reviewed this because I think it's a cool camera backpack and I think I should also come to an end now before I get another phone call here. So I will just end this video now by saying it's a cool backpack. If you would like to get it, you can find the link in the description below. And I know the last videos were filmed only here and that's a bit boring but the next videos will be outside again, some vlogs and stuff like that. So I will see you in the next videos. Please subscribe to this channel if you aren't already subscribed. Like this video if you liked it. And please let me know in the comments below what you think about this camera backpack. And yeah, that being said, thank you so much for watching. Peace. Oh. Peace.